Maybe. Forces in motion. There are many different types of forces. There is friction force, air friction, also known as wind resistance, and balance forces. Balance forces sometimes keep an object stationary. Forces can also be in balance on an object in motion. Balanced forces keep an object moving at a constant speed or direction. Forces in motion play an extremely important role in our lives as we use them every day at almost all times. Even when you don't think you are, you're usually using forces in motion. For example, to get out of bed in the morning, to throw a ball, and to lick your nose are all forces in motion. Last two shots were both examples forces of motion. motion. Another kind of force is unbalanced forces. Unbalanced forces cause a change in speed or the direction of an object. Yeah. Forces of motion is an exercise. N1, N2, N3, N4, N1, N2, N3, N4, and stretch it. And stretch it. Woo! Yeah. 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 Here's a short clip by Bill Nye that has nothing to do with the kind of force <laughs> called Forces of Fury. It just sounds cool. It's time for Mind Your Manners with Billy Kwan. Today's episode, Forces of Fury. Oh, nice break. Yes. I'm really hitting these babies. I've got the big mole going here. Yes. You know, momentum depends on how much things weigh and how fast they are moving. I don't care, you're not gonna make it. Well, oh, watch this. Huh? Oh. Achoo! Oh! Hey, you, Mr. Cue Ball Head! You just ruined the most perfect oh. shot ever! No, we must fight! Well, all right, then let me limber up first. Oh. Very nice momentum. You fool! The more something weighs, the more momentum it has! Aww. Remember, kids, be like Billy! Know your momentum! And that concludes the presentation about forces in motion. Thanks.